allow me to present a superb 1978 25th anniversary edition Corvette. performance was down from the past so they they emphasize refinement and touring and, and that ethos is really evident in this car um, it, it's it's almost a miniature Cadillac as much as it is a sports car really a pleasant car to drive um, well well worth considering adding it to your collection and uh, I would certainly like to take it home with me well I do hope you enjoyed the first malaise motors road test video I mean it was shot very off the cuff, very um, impromptu, first one I've ever done. So in future, I'd like to script them a little better and maybe come up with a humorous twist or two. Let's face it, there is a lot of room for joking with our beloved Malaysia cars. Uh, however, the, the 78 Corvette, I think, is perhaps a bit unfairly maligned. It may have less horsepower than my Buick Park Avenue, but it was an enjoyable car to drive. It felt very much of a piece, uh, you know, which is something I didn't entirely expect with a fiberglass shell sitting on top of a steel ladder chassis and, uh, you know, transverse leaf springs. I, I expected just a little bit more of a bouncy, jittery type of vehicle, but instead it was really rather firm and taut. Uh, I enjoyed it. I, I think the bad rap they have is perhaps a bit undeserved, as with many of cars of the era. Regardless, if you want a lot of car for a reasonable amount of money, Consider late third generation Corvettes. In fact, the road test car from the video is available for purchase. Uh, if someone's interested, private message me. Hope you enjoyed. Cheers. <laughs>